Now, my next jersey that I got, um, yeah, staying in London. I went in, I think it was in 2001, I went to London again and I was on a mission. Uh, this was my first time in the UK and I never made it outside of London. I know this is a miss on my part. But yeah, I went and this time it was my aunt and my other brother Wolfgang and we had a mission. We needed to see every big Premier League stadium and I was on a mission to get a shirt from every store there. And we stayed close to Earl's Court, so the next jersey was also a Chelsea jersey, which is a little bit odd, but yeah, it was the Chelsea away jersey of the time. And I actually liked the home jersey back then better, but because I still do to some degree, I like a collar on the jersey. And then the away jersey, yeah, I had just the v-neck. But I said, I need to get this away jersey. And yeah, it is... I also like this one. It's again an umbro and it's again uh, this thick material that I already said, the home jersey head uh, that I got from 1990. This is uh, 2001. Pretty sure this is a 2001. Uh, and of course, this time I got the Premier League patches. I really want to get this. Um, this is also nice. As I said, it has this thick material. Uh, I also like the white and the blue here. And then it always drives me a little bit nuts, but they have this white thin stripe. And of course, with the Premier League logo, I can't open it. It drives me a little bit nuts. I know it's crazy me. Uh, and I didn't get a number on the back. So this is plain on the back. Um, that would have been way too expensive. I actually, I was looking at getting f at least four, if not five uh, jer jerseys. Um, I ended up not getting the Fulham. I ended up not getting the West Ham. Um, was just too much. I regret both of them. And I think for West Ham I didn't even find a store back then. But you know, I got a scarf for every team. That was the other thing. I wanted to get a scarf and I got as many shirts as possible. <sighs> a lot of money spent, but yeah. Back then I didn't have a family. I was single and yeah. Okay, let's look at this jersey. It has the Fly Emirates, which is so funny uh, seeing Chelsea with Fly Emirates because now it's the Arsenal sponsor and also the, uh, of their stadium. But yeah, it was Fly Emirates back then. I like that the logo here is, yeah, it's the blue and actually you see it better than on the uh, blue shirt that I have. The color is nice. Again, the material is very thick and you have this very subtle pin strapping in there. This is of course sewn on. Um, there's some ventilation here on the back. I don't know if you can, yeah, back of the sleeves and on the underarms. It goes all the way down here. You see kind of still it's a ventilation panel and then it goes on the back. I actually also like the tail. You know, you get this pin strapping here. Uh, you have it on the front. On the side, it goes down from this. Oh, this is hard to see. It goes down from the sleeves here and it ends. It is actually outlined blue on the bottom. This is a really nice feature. And then on the back, it continues, but it doesn't, uh, the pin strapping also continues, but doesn't go all the way down but actually forms kind of a little bit of a beep. And then I really like the stripe here on the back. I, I know it's just a, something special and you have CFC here, a little tag. Yeah, another jersey I like. Again, these umbra uh, I like the material. It's very, very sturdy. And it's one of those that I like to wear when it's not so warm outside, but I still want a very nice jersey. I've uh, also worn this on as pajamas. It's wrong in my opinion, but I've done that. Again, another jersey that I really like. Unfortunately, the sponsor here gets a little bit fade and because it collects all the dirt, but also at the time, this raised embossed style. That was really cool. This was something you wanted to have. Yep, another Chelsea jersey. Now let's see what I got next. If you enjoyed this video, please hit like and subscribe to my channel. If you've already done so, I would like to thank you for your support. It is very much appreciated. Also, check out the accompanying blog at the link provided in the description below and at the end of this video. Thank you for watching and until next time.